What is happening my people? Perfected Chaos here and we are back on Generation Zero and this is the Three Wheeled Update DLC. Greetings Survivors. Thank you for joining us as we round out the year with one smaller release before we ramp up our efforts for what's in store in 2024. Tomorrow the Three Wheeled Update arrives on all platforms. It brings a new vehicle, new customization and randomization options, and a new seasonal event and bug fixes. Here is what is in store for you. New vehicle, the Flak Moped. This traditional Swedish moped has been modified to feature a frontal flatbed supported by two smaller wheels. This allows for easy transportation of goods or friends Topping out at a 50 km an hour, the flak moped has quite some energy hiding in those tiny wheels. While one person is driving, another, or multiple, can get onto the flatbed and act as their protection detail. Currently, equipment cannot be placed directly onto the flatbed. That's a functionality we want to add in the future update, however, there are ways around that limitation that lead to some hilarious behaviours and outcomes. We can't wait until you find them all and post about them on social media. Don't forget to tag us when you do. New DLC Reinforced Flak Moped Pack This DLC brings additional functionality to the Flak Moped in the shape of three variants that each specialised for a specific purpose. The utility flak moped has a full workbench installed on its flatbed, giving you access to your storage box and recycling station and the crafting station all while on the move. The ramming flak moped features a reinforced frontal wall that functions as a protection for your passengers and doubles as a battering ram to inflict maximum damage by running over machines. The off-road flak moped has been augmented with an improved suspension system and better tyres so you can ride at full speed, even in the thicket. This DLC is available alongside the three-wheeled update on the 12th of December at a price point of $6.99 or a regional equivalent. We can't wait to see what crazy shenanigans you'll get up to once you get your hands on these. New Procedural Mission Locations We are listening to all the feedback around the procedural missions and how we can make them even more interesting, engaging and rewarding. New location options have been added to the Resistance Dead Drop, Resistance Radio Maintenance and High Value Target Procedural Missions. This means that there will be more variation in the way these missions play out when they are available. Please let us know how will they play out for you and report any bugs you encounter on our forums. New Companion Name Parts We've heard lots of positive comments about the naming options for companions, but we also know that there are a lot more names that you'd like us to add. In this iteration, we've added 23 new name parts. Titles, Sister, Brother, Comrade and Reverend. Prefixes, Mad, Steel, Bullet, Scrap, Laser, Cuddle, Fuzz, Mecha and Robo. Suffixes, K47UR, 54MUR, K1M1. 54M509, Guard, Pal, Bob, Killer, Sprocket and Bandit. Some of these were suggested by the community. Some are devs dogs names and some are just cool in general. We hope you enjoy the new combinations. New event, Winter Snowball Fight. Snow and frost have taken over Ostertorn and it's time to stick it to your friends literally. From the 16th until the 31st of December you will find mounds of snow all over the map. You can use these to grab yourself some snowballs which you can throw at your friends. Landing a hit will topple the other person over until they get back up. 
After getting up from a hit, you will be temporarily unaffected by snowballs and get a chance to return the favour. You can also throw snowballs at machines if you want, but it won't do anything and you'll probably regret it, but the option is there. If you don't want to get blindsided by your co-op partner while you're fighting machines, don't worry. You can turn on permanent snowball immunity in the game options. Now go out and make sure you bring a change of clothes so you don't catch a cold. Quality of life. Hit the model of the selected weapon in the background of the augmentation process to declutter the screen. Made it easier to loot runners, seekers, hunters, lynxes and firebirds. Improved companion voice box icons. Hit the chat when the player is in a menu to prevent visual overlap. Adjusted the size of the companion collision to better represent its actual size. It can now walk through bunker doors so no more leaving your buddy out in the rain. And updated the game credits. Well, that brings an end to this update. Thank you so much for listening. My name is Perfected Chaos and I shall catch you guys on the next one. Peace.